That's 145 that one. This is our little Corolla with 200,000 Ks on it and we saved it from a, a life at the wreckers yard. Um, hadn't been in service for four years but uh, it seems basically pretty sound to us so we've done a, an initial compression test. We're about to put the flush in there. Uh, the middle number's a bit low so we're hoping they'll come up a bit but we'll see how we go off the flush. Okay, so we've got to add uh, uh, a charge of the flushing oil concentrate there, roughly four litre sump, so we're going to need about uh, 50 odd mils. And Jimmy's just squirting it out now, and uh, we'll be good to go. Right, yeah, so I've done over 30 minutes of uh, at a high idle. I've just topped the idle back down again, and we believe it's a little bit quieter. Uh, at the top end, so uh, we're going to uh, shut it down and then do a, another compression test, see how it's there. Okay, this is cylinder two, we're going to do a compression test after the flush, and uh, last time was 145 psi, Jimmy will just crank it up now and we'll see how it goes. We've got 178, 175, sorry. Yeah, we're all finished now and uh, you can see the results there for yourself. Uh, compression's a little bit higher on each cylinder pretty well, number four remained the same, but the thing is they're more even this time. And all we've done really is an oil change and uh, use the flushing oil concentrate to clean out around the rings and remove that carbon. Uh, less carbon around the rings, better seal, more compression. Plenty more information on our website if you'd like to go there, costeffective.com.au. Cheers.